Hi, Mike from Access Hosting. In this video, we're going to show you our remote desktop hosting solution with multiple concurrent users from two different devices. So let's start off on the iPad. This is running iOS 7, and we're simply going to use Safari. There's no additional software required. We visit the Power RDP site, and we log in as a demo user. Now watch carefully, because what's going to happen is your iPad is now going to be transitioned into a full-blown Windows desktop. And from here, we can go ahead and launch the Access 2010 application that we've gone ahead and built to share with our Windows user on the other side. So now let's take a look at the Windows machine that's also connected via remote desktop to this same database. First thing we're going to do is take a look at a few of the existing records and go ahead and update the inventory information for these pinball machines. Now that we've updated the inventory information, let's go ahead and add a brand new record into the Access database that will be visible to the iPad user. Now keep in mind we are using Access 2010 here, not a watered down web compatible version of the Access product, but all the features and functions that any Access user will be familiar with, things like the forms and the report builder and the ability to add attachments and pictures as fields in your local database. So we've gone ahead and created a new record. Let's go ahead and verify that those changes have been committed and take a look at what this looks like from the Access user's perspective. So here we are on the iPad and it's really just a matter of going up to the Access toolbar and hitting Refresh All to see all those changes that were committed from the Windows side. This includes the inventory updates and the new record that we just added. This is a solution that can really be scaled to an unlimited number of users. You're not restricted to just two users inside of the same Access database. If you need more information about our remote desktop hosting solutions, please visit accesshosting.com.